Hi and welcome from beautiful Newport slash Huntington Beach. I'm out on a gorgeous ride and enjoying this awesome day, watching some killer flag football on the beach and volleyball and other sports. Super fun lifestyle here. Anyway, have you been frustrated recently by Facebook's inability to text you a six digit SMS code? I've run into it recently and it is a bear. I've gone into all kinds of forums trying to find solutions to it. And there are a lot of YouTube videos, unlike this one, that tell you to go in and make sure you're receiving SMS messages, maybe call Verizon or AT&T or T-Mobile, um, see if maybe they're blocking anything. Aside from that, they are telling you to uh, go in and make sure that your number is authenticated otherwise. And it's just a when you try to do it through Facebook, it's an endless loop. Um, you can try to, at least I did, you can see send another way or try another way. And the other way just says the only way that you can do it is through texting. So it's a conundrum and it's super, super frustrating. Well, check out this video. If you're also experiencing this issue, I found a way to solve it and you're going to really love this one. Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do is go to Facebook.com. And when you do, you'll see that here are the accounts that Facebook currently has for you. These are your recent logins. This is the one that I'm unable to get a six digit text code sent to me. It just, it says it sent it. I've done it a hundred times. It doesn't send it, super frustrating. And so I finally figured out how to make this work, how to make it, how to recover the account. What you do is you're gonna click on create new account. I know that this is a problem that a lot of people have experienced. I've been in a ton of forums trying to find the answer for myself and there were a lot of suggestions, but they just didn't work and this one does. So you're going to click on create new account and when you do, you're going to fill in your first name, last name. That can be your real name, of course. Um, and then you're going to put in the mobile number that you were unable to use on this previous account here. You're going to go ahead on this new account that you're creating, put that same mobile number in, your accurate mobile number, create a password, put in your birth date, and then fill in your gender, and click sign up. When you do, you're going to receive an immediate text and you'll see that that text comes to this number that you enter and it's now going to create this new account for you on Facebook and it's going to take that number from this previous account and honor it on this current new account. So after you do that and you verify this new account, you can go ahead and log out of it, just immediately log out of it. Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to come back to the account. This is the account I previously had tied to that legitimate cell phone number that I could not access because it kept requesting me to verify with a six digit code that I was not receiving. So I'm going to click on this account and I'm going to type in my password. And when I do, what it did, and I don't think I'm going to be able to show it here, but I'll log in. When I logged in before, it's going to say, hey, verify that this is you. And it's going to give me a selection of using my email address, using my cell phone number, or using an authentication application. I chose to use the app called Authy, which you can get from the App Store or Google Play. Um, you can also use Google Authenticator, it doesn't matter. But I chose to use Authy. So now what it does is it sends um, the request to a process where you have to use an authenticator. So I'm going to go to my Authy app. I'm going to type in the six digit code that it gives me here. These codes go away like in 60 seconds. They want you to uh, make sure that you use them right away. It helps to validate that it's you. And you'll see now I have access to this account. This is the account that before I was totally locked out of because I couldn't use the verification system that Facebook gives me. It was really frustrating because here's the screen that I continually saw. I would put in my six digit code here and nothing would happen. It just, it would never send. I never received it. Like I said, I did it, I don't know, probably a hundred times. And when I clicked on didn't receive a code, it would say, try another way. 
And when I click to try another way, it says, oh, you can only do it via text and we can only send X amount of texts and X amount of time. It was a super, super frustrating process. And now I've shown you exactly how to rob that number from the previous account, associate it to a new account, and then you can go back and choose a new way to authorize that, that previous Facebook account in order to access it. So I hope you found this video super useful and able to utilize it in order to get back into your Facebook account and actually receive the six digits that you need on the new account so that you can rob it from the old account and then you can you choose a new method to authenticate you for the account that you were locked out of. If you did get value out of this video, I'd super appreciate it if you would like the video and subscribe to my channel because I find these challenges come up a lot in digital marketing and in digital media and I'm not a quitter. I continue to dig at a problem until I find the solution. I was really happy to find this one. Thanks much.